In the mid to late 16th century, a group of people rose up from churches in England. They opposed the oppressiveness of the clergy, as well as the formalism in the church. They sought a pure religious creed, a pious life, a holy church, and a free nation. They were called the Puritans. In 1604, the British royal family ordered all Puritans to return to the state church and obey the bishop. Otherwise, they would face expulsion or even execution. So the Puritans were forced to leave Europe behind and head for North America. They were followed by larger numbers of Puritans. Some of them came from Oxford or Cambridge universities. They were generally more educated than most Europeans. They advocated for the concepts of autonomy, equality, and democracy, as well as God's teachings. They infused the United States Declaration of Independence and the American Constitution with these values. Without the Puritans, the United States of America would not have come into existence. And the separation of the three powers would never have been set up. So not only were the Puritans the cornerstone of the establishment of the USA, they were the pioneers who made America strong. On July 4th, 1776, when the United States Declaration of Independence was passed, an independent, rising, multi-ethnic country was formed in North America. That is the United States of America we know today. George Washington, the first president of the United States, said, It is the duty of all nations to acknowledge the providence of Almighty God, to obey His will, to be grateful for His benefits, and humbly to implore His protection and favor. Let's 
After the Civil War, the American economy developed rapidly. In 1894, the U.S. became the country with the greatest gross industrial output worldwide. Economic prosperity in the U.S. followed the outbreak of World War I. After the war, the U.S. turned from a country in debt owing six billion U.S. dollars into a creditor country that was owed more than 10 billion U.S. dollars. It was the most prosperous nation on the planet. After World War II, America's military strength continued to grow, and it established more than 5,000 military bases all over the world. From an economic or a military perspective, the U.S. had become an undisputed world superpower. This established its political position in the world. On the basis of adhering to its founding principles of freedom, democracy, and equality, the U.S. took up its duty to play the role of the global police. So the U.S. has continued to intervene and interfere with world trends, to effectively curb the expansion of authoritarian forces, and to protect large numbers of people from all walks of life who have been persecuted for religious or political reasons. It has also greatly contained the spread of various evil forces and weakened the damage done to mankind by evil forces. In a sense, the U.S. has played an important role in stabilizing the global situation and providing a balance for world order. It plays an irreplaceable role in safeguarding and stabilizing our global situation.